Hey everyone, this is Prince Watercress, and welcome back to Let's Play Bing Bing Bingo for the Super Famicom. In the last video, we played our second game of bingo with Amita Bingo, which had a Christmas theme, very annoying holiday style music, and let us learning the hard way about the one line bonus whenever anybody gets a bingo, or rather two bingos, at the same time. Which, in this case, happened to be Computer, who managed to win the game with the one-line bonus. We are now going to play Cannon Bingo, which has a pirate theme, obviously. The pirate captain will help you play bingo. Don't fear the cannon fire. We won't. And once again, we have this menu. We know what we're doing here versus play, one player versus computer. I'll go ahead and choose this card just right off the gate. And from here, these cannons are moving. When you get the cannon color you want, you'll then fire a cannon and then you'll get a number for that color. Black is B, yellow is I, red is N, green is G, and blue is O. We got B4. Nobody had that. Now let's see what the computer does. So, obviously, The, you have control over which letter you pick, but not the number. And B9, who had B9? Ah, it was the computer. So if I wanted O, I could just pick the blue cannon and there we go. And I love how the cannonball matches the cannon it comes out of. 34, I got 34. So if I shoot a shoot from the red cannon, I get a red cannonball, green gives me a green cannonball, so on and so forth. Thankfully, timing this whole butt pressing A to get the color you want part isn't all that hard. You just wait for the one you want to come to the middle and then you press A. What number you get is entirely up to chance. And G58, I have that, the computer does not. Um, hmm. I want to believe that this is probably the second easiest of the four themes to kind of... Maybe the third easiest. When it comes to trying to get what you want, I believe. I-25. I mean, you have direct control over which color you get, and I can't believe that the computer had that and I didn't. You have control over which letter you get, but what number you get out of the 15, it's, it's completely random. The next theme that we're going to be playing has even greater control. Hint, hint, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. And another I, I-30. Who got that? I did. And let's see here. What are we gonna get this time? Um, I'd like to get a red number that I want and let's see if N33 shows up. Great, it's another one that the computer needed and had. And the computer now has a turn. It's like I just gave that to the computer. And the computer's going for green. G52. I can't say I blame the computer for doing that. The computer has that, but it's not part of the bingo. And let's see here. I like to get my hands on a B number and see what happens. 
And the, I keep getting numbers the computer has. The computer had two. I didn't. Come on now. And if this keeps up, the computer is probably going to get all the numbers that I want. So we have the captain shouting at the orders. There's one guy swapping the deck. One guy keeps moving the cannons. I got I-24. And another guy gets to shoot cannonballs out of the cannons, which is pretty nice. Everybody on that ship is doing their part there. I don't like it. Especially that guy who's swabbing the floor. Apparently you get to keep him in position when the screen fades. Also there's a guy climbing up and down the crow's nest too. I'm guessing this is mine. Yeah, but it is mine. B15, I think I have that one. I do. Let's get some things. I personally want to get my hands on I-23. Though the, may the computer may get it for me, if just by chance. And the computer definitely takes your time waiting for the color that they want. 57, nobody had that. Nobody had G57. And let me see if I can get my hands on a yellow number. Preferably 23. 29. And nobody had that. Well, there's always other numbers that I can land on. Absolutely. And... Computer's going for O. O63. Who's got that? Neither person did. So it's back to me for this turn. And I'm still going for a yellow number. I-20. And that is one that the computer had. Jeez, if I keep this up, I may be giving the computer a bingo. So this isn't a bad theme by any means. If you know what you're doing and you're particularly lucky, you can get any bingo you want. Only reason why I mentioned the being lucky part is it's all down to the numbers you get. And 073, that is a number that the computer needed and got. And that leaves me nowhere, really. I'm going to land on I again, just because I can. I-18. And that was one that the computer needed. Jeez, I'm just giving the computer numbers now. Maybe I should just stop, but I'm kind of too stubborn to do this. Then again, the computer might give me a number I need. What do we get for N? 44. Hey, that's a number I needed. Let's go ahead and do something here. And let's go for another black number. Let's go for a B. B8. And I needed that one. Cool. Not exactly a number I was going for, but one that I had nonetheless. I'm having a lot more fun with these bingo themes than I thought I would. I mean, I kind of got going with the slot bingo. And I kind of got more into it with the Amita Bingo, and G55 was a number that the computer needed. Wonderful. And let's see if I can get my hands on a blue number. As I was saying, I started having fun with the slot bingo, and then I 
it kind of picked up with Amita. 065. Both of us had 065. I'm really starting to have fun with more fun with this one after playing the first two themes. Though I think the last one will probably be the most fun of all. Given what little I played of all four themes. And N37. The computer actually needed that. I'm going to stay away from black for the time being. And I'm just going to go straight for yellow. I-17. What do we have here? Nothing. And now it's the computer's turn, which means anything can happen. But I'm especially afraid of giving a number to the computer. Just landing on one that they need. And N36. That's one that I have. And I'm getting close to a bingo. Let me see if I can go for an O. Oh, it's the computer's turn. Well, may maybe the computer will get go for something else. Let's see what happens. Or is it mine? It is mine. Okay, I thought it was computer's turn. Because it was taking so long. 074, that is one that the computer needed. Great. Well, the computer can pick their number now. Watch as they go for green. They're not going for green. They're not going for green. They're going for black. B12. And nobody got that. So, let me see if I can get a number that the computer does not need. G60. And nobody has G60. So, it's back to the computer for this one. Something telling me that this game will probably go a little quicker than Amita. I mean, I just have that feeling. B11. And that is one that the computer needed. Great. And let's see here. I'm going to go for black as well. And see what happens. B7. And nobody had that. So it's back to the computer. Who will probably pick a completely random number. Or in this case a completely random color. Let's see what happens. Okay, they're going for red. Not for green like I thought they would. And N38. N38. Nobody has that. So it's back to me. And yeah, that's too early. Okay. I'm going to go for another black number. Let's see what B we get. B10. And nobody had B10, amazingly. And let's see what the computer does. At this rate, I'm running out of things to say here. And they're going for red again. N31. Both of us had it and in the exact same spot. Despite having different cards. So let's see here. I need 5 and 68. Actually, I need 45 for the best bingo. For the quickest bingo. And the computer needs 48. Both of us can get one, but if we get one, 
Oh yeah, that's another easy bingo for the for the computer too. Yeah. Well, no pain, no gain. Let's see what happens. B3. Once again, nothing. I'm getting all the numbers except the one that I want. I'm now starting to wonder if my tactics are going to make the game shorter or longer. And G54. Hey, that's one that I needed. I'll take that. Let me see if I can go for 45. I like to be able to go for 45. But let's make sure we land on red. N43. I think that's one the computer needs. No? No. Hmm, okay. Well, let's see what the computer does. And B13. I think I need that one, or maybe the computer does. Yeah, it's one the computer does. I remember seeing 13 somewhere. And let's see if we can go for 43. Well, I have to wait for the cannons to go at the quickest speed first. And there's 45. I mean, the computer gets it, but I do too. And I now get the first bingo. But the rate that this is going... Oh, boy. Um, if, if we get B1, that'll be two bingos and a one line bonus for the computer and that'll put me in a major disadvantage and nobody got 67 I basically want to avoid the black cannon for now as much as I don't want to do that G53 and nobody had that one Let's see what's going on here. I need to get my hands on a ton of numbers. N42, I don't need that one, but the computer probably does. Yep, they sure do. That... They're still going to be able to get a two simultaneous bingos. Not sure how I feel about that. But we don't need to fire the red cannon anymore. That's something. Well, anyway, let's see what we can get. I-26. And nobody had that. Well, the computer can get just about anything now. I'm not going for black. They're going for... Why are you still going for red? That benefits no one. You just wasted a good cannonball, sir. Let's see what we can get. I-23. Did we even get I-23? Well, we have now, and it's a number that we both have. And let's see what happens when the computer picks a number. Or a cannon, rather. A color. Yeah, something tells me that this game is going to end within a couple minutes. G47. And that's one that I was looking for. Now, I need 72, and while we both have it, I will get a bingo if I get 72. So, I might as well take my chances and get blue. 069. Well, that'll still get me something. Well, it looks like I'm going for yellow. Just, 
to see what happens. Let us see what the computer lands on and then we can work from there. Oh, you landed on yellow. I-27, I needed that. I know for a fact that I needed that. Let us go for yellow again and see what happens. Black and yellow. I-28. Don't need that. I don't think the computer does either. Nope. The only good numbers anyone needs are 16 for the computer and 22 for me. Let's see what happens. And you landed on red. You did not benefit yourself. Why are you even landing on red? Neither of us need it. Especially not you, computer player. Let's see what the yellow cannon gives us. Finally, I-22. What does that do for us? Ooh, now I got the one-line bonus. Get out of here. <laughs> yes. Yes. I have the advantage now. <laughs> oh, I did not expect that to happen. And you'll probably get I-16. Yes, you will. Which means you get a bingo. But you can still get two simultaneous ones. Hmm... I am going to go for blue and see what happens. I ain't going for black. 71. Nobody needed that. There's only like three numbers that are going to do anything for anybody. And you made a wise choice in Landed on a color you actually needed. G51. Who's got what? No, we, we don't have that. And... I might as well go ahead and go for green as well. See what happens. G56. And that is one that the computer needed right there oh man so many potential hmm 62 is probably going to do the least damage to any advantage in this game that I might have so I might as well just keep going for blue I mean it's all I can do at this point and why did you do that Neither of us need this color. Okay. Let us keep landing on blue and see where we end up. 64. And nobody had that. And yeah, we really are getting down to the wire and in a much quicker fashion to B5 well that's one color I have oh dear I'm staying away from black I am staying far away from the black cannon why am I going for green G59 and I am just messing this up for myself aren't I I should have went for blue. I pressed A too early. I should have kept going for blue. Thinking that... Or, but I went for green that one time. Oh boy. G50. I don't think either of us have this. No wait, I do! 
Oh, 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 oh. Wait a minute. If I land on B1. If whoever gets B1 will probably ruin it for the other person. I may have to go for the black cannon now. And also, it's my turn. What am I doing? B1! And now both of us get a lone line bonus, but... Oh, man. Oh, man. It is down to the wire now. I'm going to have to keep going for blue. It's all I can do now. Why are you going for that? You will not win. At this rate, the... Uh Computer is doing dumb things. I need 68. If I can get 68, I will win this one. 72. And does the computer... No, no. Computer needs 62. So we're getting pretty close to the end of this one. Oh, this is a really nice fight to the finish. And... Why? Just why? I mean, it can't be hard for the computer to, you know, not do this. Also, I need for the thing to go at this speed before I press A. And what am I going to get here? 61. Neither of us have this one. And I'm going to have to keep going for blue until I win. And I'm going to get a drink of tea. And once again, what is the computer doing? All right. Time to go for blue, as always. And now. 68, I win. You're the weakest link. Goodbye. I'm not even going to lie. That was pretty fun. I, I, I just knew that if I kept plugging away at the, uh, at the blue cannon, I would just win. Whew, that was beautiful. Especially when B1 got landed on and I got so much closer to winning. Oh, that was great. Huh, that is now our third theme of Bingo done. And for the next and final video, we'll be doing Skydive Bingo. Which is going to look pretty nice. There's obviously a skydiving theme. And I cannot wait to play this one. Because you have the most control over what number you land on. Assuming you know what to do. But I'll have to show that off next time. Until then, this is Prince Watercrest. Take care, stay safe, and thanks for watching!